Hey guys, what's happening? Beautiful day up here today. Beautiful day up here today. Uh, no humidity. Um, upper 70s. It's absolutely brilliant day. Had a brilliant day yesterday. Me and Mrs. Mack went to Portland, man. For some of the best seafood you'll ever have in your life. Place called Jay's Oyster House. It is right on the docks up in Maine, in Portland. Jeez, we had a great time. What a beautiful day. Good seafood. Took her up for her birthday, which was Tuesday. And thank you to everybody who wished her a happy birthday. Um, much appreciated. Thank you, people. Thank you. Uh, what's going on in the shop today? Well, we got some good weather. We're going to see if we can get some paint down on some of these things. Uh, but before we go any further, go check this guy out. Um, he just subbed me this morning. So I went and checked him out and, um, <laughs> I don't know how I missed this gentleman. I'm not, I don't know what his name is. This is just his channel name. Um, but, uh, great work. Yeah, great work. Um, if you can sub him, uh, please do. He's only got 57 subs, and uh, his work, he should have a lot more than that. So if you guys can, go check him out. And I uh, I sent Jeff his link so Jeff can uh, do his thing. I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to put the link in the description. I'm an idiot, so maybe somebody can tell me or show me uh, or what. But as of right now, I can't do it. So, go check him out if you can, guys. Oh, look at that. Did it right the first time again. I'm getting pretty good at this. Getting pretty good at this. So, on the Bugatti, we got some of the motor. I got the motor Ushied. I, uh, Ushied the motor block, the, just the block. I still have work. Got the two pulleys in. I'm going to put my own belt on it. Um, I got most of the parts painted up. I'm working on the carburetors. Um, there's four carburetors. There's a, I just got to paint the bottom half. I'm debating, trying to debate on what color to paint them. Uh, what else? We got, I showed you the dash. I got that done. Um, I'm debating on what color to paint paint my lower half because it's going to be two-toned. I got I got some taping off to do on this before I do anything though. So uh, we're going to go from there. Um, radiators all together. Had to do a lot of sanding on this to get this back piece to fit right. Um, it was just way too big for some, I don't know why, but it had a, whether it moved in the mold or what, but Christ, what a job I had getting that thing to fit. Um, but we took care of that. Um, I got all my ties together. I think I showed you guys this in the last video of the trouble I had with those. Um, I'm getting my hood together. This was a, what, two, four, five piece hood. Uh, I'm just gluing it all together. It's not going to have any open flaps or anything. Um, going with that. Uh, what else? What else? What else? That's about it. Oh, I got the. I've uh, been working on the. Uh, been working on the exhaust. So that's going to be ushied and weathered and painted. Uh, I got all my seats together. Got the seats all together. Got the seams out of those. They were all, another thing that had big seams in them for some reason. I don't know. I don't know why, but I mean they were like one one piece of the mold was higher than the other piece. You know what I mean? Almost like they had moved when they were being being formed. But we got took we took care of that. It was it wasn't huge, but I mean there was enough to make a difference, you know. So we got both of those done. Steering wheel's all done. That needs a little highlight. 
Um, the chrome on this thing was real tough. Um, I had to leave it in the uh, the super uh, clean for uh, Christ well over a half hour. Um, it's ama it, ama it amazes me how some chrome co comes off in seconds, and other stuff you got to leave in there for, for for you know for a half hour an hour before it'll touch it. So it must be different chroming methods or, or whatever. But uh, yeah, sometimes I can put a piece in there and I look and it's I no sooner put it in and it's done and but the chrome off this kit, Christ, you got to and then I uh, not only going to do it. Uh, but I have to take a brush and, and brush the chrome off. Um, it doesn't dissolve it; it breaks it up. But then you got to, like I said, you got to go in there with a brush and then brush the brush the chrome off it. So I don't know, different methods, I guess. But uh, yeah, that's where we are there. Um, like I said, hopefully I can get some painting done today. We got we got some good weather, thank God. But uh, we shall see, as they say, right? And then uh, I think I'm going to be doing a plane next, I think. Getting all caught out. I should have done a plane after this, but I'll do one. I mean, I should have done a, a plane instead of this, but that's all right. That's all right. We got to, we'll get it. We'll get it. <clears throat> yeah, the river's, river's real high. Ribbons, well, come on, we'll go take a look. We'll bring you out and we'll show you the river come up real high after the rain we got the other day, man. Oh, the last two days. Not yesterday. Day before yesterday and the day before that. So that would be what? Monday and Tuesday. There we go, Charlie. You'll remember it. Ah! Hey! What are you doing? What are you doing up there? You watching for chipmunks? Huh? A ah, girl. Not a girl. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. That ride beat the shit out of me yesterday. It's only like a two and a half hour ride up to up to Portland from here. But you know, up two and a half up and two and a half back. <laughs> I think we were there for a couple hours. I think we were there for two and a half. Maybe, I think we were there for as long as it took to drive up. But well worth the trip, man. Just well worth the trip. Yeah, look at how high this water is. The line across our pond is gone, and I think it's higher than it was. But it comes it comes way up when it rains. When we get good rain, it comes way up. And within a day, today, tomorrow, it'll it'll be right back down again. Pretty weird how that happens, but but that's that. Oh, just a nice day, man. No humidity, but I guess it's they're saying by the beginning of next week, it's it's all coming back. So, but we'll take the reprieve while we can. Oh God! Oh, 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 oh my back, my legs and my back kill me after after that. Uh, oh well, you know. Not a spring chicken anymore. <laughs> yeah, God. There we go. So, like I say, hopefully uh, we get some paint down today. Um, that would that would be tremendous. So I gotta I gotta put all my loot that I got the other day. I gotta put all that away. That's still sitting here. Excuse me. That's all still sitting here. You, you magnificent bastards Jesus I'm telling you well just a great bunch of people man that's unbelievable unbelievable but I think that's the best thing about this is just all the great people especially after meeting now the other day and meeting all the guys last last November down the Acme and I hope to meet a couple newer guys that down the Acme this year um, I think Mr. BG and Mrs. BG are going, and I think uh, I think Benny said he was going to try to get there, and I think Brian from BAS, him and his wife are going down. Of course, Tom, Rick, and uh, and Rick, Cletus. <laughs> uh, I think Randy's going, the big dog. Not sure, Bob. 
We'll see. We'll see. But hopefully everybody that can make it makes it. That'd be that'd be cool. Oh, no. All right, guys. I hit my limit. You know, we were rambling on. I got work to do. Almost time. I think we're gonna have lunch for us. I don't know if I'm down here after lunch and get out the hams and start banging. <laughs> but uh, all right, boys. Everybody, take care. Guys, ladies, ferrets, dogs, cats, birds, turtles. <laughs> oh man, too funny. All right, guys. Have a good one, huh? You know what I say? Peace out.